Georgia is home to an abundance of native species, but unfortunately, it's also home to a lot of unwelcome visitors that can harm our ecosystems and cause exponential monetary damage. Things like kudzu, wild pigs, lionfish, and the tegu lizard, and that's just naming a few. For something to be considered an invasive species, um, it's got to be non-native, usually non-native to the U.S. Is, is usually when you would put it into that category. And then causing some kind of economic, environmental, or human health harm. Invasive plants and species cause billions of dollars in damage each year all over the country, which is why the University of Georgia started the Center for Invasive Species and Ecosystem Health back in 2008 where people like Chuck Bargeron have been working on resources to help fight this costly issue. Our primary mission is outreach. I mean, what, what we do is extension, is outreach, and we do a lot of that through the development of information technology tools. One technology tool they started is this website, which is essentially a database to help identify and track invasive species. It was built as a way to track invasive species all across North America. And so when I mention the different projects that we work on in different parts of the country, um, that is really focused on tracking where invasive species have been seen um, and the impact that they have um, to the areas that they are, they are found in. Outbreaks can be detrimental to ecosystems and can be a huge financial burden. Thankfully, here in Georgia, we haven't had any major problems, but that doesn't mean it couldn't happen. We have been very fortunate that we have not had a, a species that has come in and really devastated one of our strong um, agri or forestry industries in the state. Um, and that is, is where, you know, the awareness and, and keeping, you know, eyes open for, for new things is really important because um, being able to stop something when it's in the early stages is a whole lot cheaper than being able, than having to wait till it really explodes. The website is free to use and has several resources on there to help prevent an invasive species outbreak here in Georgia. We've got um, a, a lot of those on, on, our, on our various websites that, that we manage. Um, our, uh, our URL is bugwood.org, um, B-U-G-W-O-O-D.org. We have a lot of materials on there. Um, um, we have a homeowner's guide and a landowner's guide, um, you know, specific for Georgia in terms of what folks um, can do and what, what to look for. Reporting in Tifton for the Farm Monitor, I'm John Holcomb.